Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to this edition of Follow Suit, Fashion Unfiltered. Follow Suit is a mantra, which means to follow the suit. And as you follow it, you're going to come to realize the suit is a role model and a mentor whose purpose is to give guidance to the young men of this community and as well as to society. And it is my goal to honor and salute some of the individuals who not only put on the suit, but they wear it well. Hence the point, my guest today. Good morning, everyone. My name is Anthony Thompson. I'm the CEO and founder of Follow Suit, which is a mentoring program. And my mission is to inspire young men to dress for success. And I, threw, I do that through a core of educational workshops, one being to build a suit, one being how to tie a tie, one being health and wellness, one being financial literacy, and I cap it off with a vision board and a goal setting. And on completion of these workshops, the young men receive a custom-made suit that, build, that they learn how to build in the very beginning. So I'm gonna piggyback off of Casey and the chance meeting that we met at a health and wellness black men's mental health conference. He said to me, Anthony, you know the work that you're doing is saving lives. The light bulb went off in my head. You see, a young man in my community, if he decides to drop out of school, he's on the path to suicide. A young man in my community, if he chooses to join the gang, he's on the path to suicide. If he decides to indulge in drugs or sell drugs, he's on the path to suicide. So that's my connection with Samaritans. So further along, me and Casey, along with Steven, who's the director of education, we formed a partnership and we came up with our own workshop called My Brother's Keeper. And the goal of that is to create a space for young men to come in, have a safe space where they can learn. They also can express themselves. So we give them the tools and the skills to see and identify what behavior that could lead them on the wrong path. And there's a three set thing which we sort of use the curriculum that was already created by Samaritans and we try to make it speak to the urban community. Because as Stephen said, the numbers are astronomical about how many young black males and brown males are committing suicide. So with the three steps that they learn the skills is about asking, listening, and most importantly, if all else, know where to go and get help. And we give them that information. I was overwhelmed when one of the young men during this workshop, he was nine years old, and he was so spont, you know, he, he got the gist of the whole message right away at nine years old, I couldn't believe it. And during that time, he opened up to everyone in the room and he talked about how he had been being bullied for the last two years. So right then and there, it was the seal of approval for me that the work that we was doing was well worth it. Samaritan has a slogan, community and connection. And with that being said, Samaritan is my connection and I am now the bridge to my community. Overwhelmed, I have the privilege I'm gonna to introduce to you two of my very first two participants in my Follow Suit program. These are great young men. They put a big smile on my face every time I think about them. So Hello everyone, my name is Joshua Ramjeet, a rising junior at Northeastern University. Hello. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Cadio Barboza. I'm currently a rising junior at Babson College. Not only were we able to get these suits 
from the Follow Suit program, we were able to get so much more. With Anthony, we were able to learn professionalism, what it means to be a man, which some disregard as having feelings, which it really does, and also how to carry ourselves as young black men in our community. I would then take this education and use it in interviews, in speaking, and in advocating for myself as well as my peers. Although it may seem a little funny, it's one thing to say a couple of words or give a pat on the back, but to be a key part of someone's career development and inspire them, show them that you have hope in them, as well as fostering an environment for them to be comfortable, to be heard, to feel important, can do wonders. I learned that with Follow Suit, and I'm learning that now with Samaritans. Their partnership is something that, you know, some may think is doesn't really, like something that doesn't really make sense, but it really does because, as Mr. Anthony was saying, these conversations don't always occur. Like, there's a stigma against having feelings, a stigma against feeling down, a stigma against talking about it, even if you need help. So, this partnership's able to kind of tear that apart and allow us to be heard and allow people to speak our language. We had amazing conversations, not only about fashion, but about life. Follow suit is that family-like environment, the environment you hope to have at home, the environment you try to have with friends, and the environment you can definitely find at Samaritans. Follow suit is starting to get involved with these difficult conversations. Samaritans has been involved with these, with these conversations for the past 50 years, and they're going to continue, and they're gonna continue on in making sure they provide a place of hope where people feel heard, but most importantly, they feel wanted. Together, an organization embedded in the black community, supporting our youth, and an organization dedicated to preventing suicide creates a powerful movement that can and most definitely will save lives. I mean, look at us today. We want to convey to you that we've been through so many different obstacles and we're going to go through a lot more. But organizations like Samaritans, organizations like Follow Suit, that are willing to invest in us and put so much time and dedication into us make all the difference. Just to uh, close things off, uh, we'd like to thank Mr. Anthony and the Follow Suit program for uh, teaching us how to be professionals and look good out of doing it. Thank you so much, Samaritans. <laughs>